How is the skeleton of sharks? If you are an adult, your skeleton is made up of 206 hard and dense bones that support your body, provide consistency and allow you to perform many activities such as walking, running or swimming. But, even if you are an Olympic swimmer, your skills in the water cannot parallel with that of sharks, whose skeleton is specially adapted for life in the water and for hunting prey as agile as seals. There are three main types of fish, agnathans or jawless fish, the osteichthys or bony skeleton fish, and chondrichthyans or cartilaginous skeleton fish. Sharks belong to the club of chondrichthyans, so they have no bones. Instead, they have an internal skeleton of cartilage, a substance composed of protein fibers, carbohydrates, and other substances, without calcium minerals. It is the same soft material that you have at the tip of your nose or ears. In most species of sharks, the central part of their skeleton is formed by the skull and spine, from where other important structures such as supporting arches and jaws extend. Unlike other fish, their spine extends towards the end of the upper lobe of the tail, and the upper jaw is attached to the skull. The only relatively rigid parts are the backbone and jaws, which contain deposits of calcium. Therefore, these parts are calcified cartilage. But still, they are not real bone. Why sharks do not have bones? It is an important question, and the key to understanding it is to consider them as animals that need to move efficiently. They must sometimes swim in quick bursts and even jump out of the water to chase prey. They also lack a swim bladder, an appendix full of gas that allows bony fish to float. Evidently, they need a light skeleton that helps them maintain buoyancy. Cartilage achieves all this. A soft and lighter substance than bone, that reduces their overall body mass. With its cartilaginous skeleton sharks need less energy to move through water, save strength and swim more efficiently. But having a cartilaginous skeleton does not make them fragile creatures. All the opposite, as the cartilage, despite being soft, it is very flexible and less brittle. Follow us in the social networks. Twitter Facebook YouTube Pinterest Google Plus, SoundCloud and others. For more information visit bioexpedition.com.